Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those that do not know my name, my name is Jerry Tanamaji. First of all, uh, I've been struggling and I've been struggling. I've been wanting to do videos the past days, but I just didn't have energy. Even now, I'm just like, oh, Lord help me, Lord help me. Anyway, we move. Uh, today, I want to talk to you concerning a certain issue or concerning things I've been thinking about as I do my makeup. So we're going to start with priming our face. I moisturize and all that stuff. And guys, I can't be bothered about a lot of things today because it's hot. Anyway, I'll use my primer. And I'm breaking out for the hundredth time this week. So this primer is so it, it's matte it's a matte primer and I don't always use it but for the sake of those people who want their makeup to be more matte this is for you anyway I will go in with my foundations I will mix these three foundations my Floma foundations and my two non foundations I will use my my concealer um, guys you know my routine I'll, I'll do my eyebrows and everything but let me start with my eyebrows as we chat so guys um a lot of things have been ringing in my head you know especially this topic concerning seasons and times just go in my eyebrows seasons and times um, we live we're living in a world where you know things are happening so fast like Social media is so intimidating, guys. Go to Instagram, you see people are doing well, or they're standing next to somebody's car, and they can seem as if it's their car. Um, they're doing well, they're living life, they're living lavish. And then you look at yourself, you're like, ah, I'm in my house, doing nothing, or even the little thing that you're doing, you're pushing for something. It's not where you want it to be, but it's working. Is, is this going to work? Doing my makeup and talking? Anyway, I'll try to. Uh, you're living your life like you're not where you want to be. You know you're doing something, but sometimes it feels like you're not doing anything. You know? So, let me speak for myself. For example, I've become, I was never an Instagram person, you know, but I've become very aware. I never thought I would be that person. Normally, um, I can't easily be convinced when it comes to like, when I make up my mind about something. For example, when somebody is forcing me to smoke. Or they've tried to force me. Ah, that won't happen unless I just decide to say, okay, I'm going to do, do it. Because I don't easily get influenced. I'm using my foundation to clean my eyebrows. I don't easily get influenced, right? It will take, I don't know, or I'll just accept myself and say okay let me do this so um this thing of seasons and times you know even the bible says there's time for everything there's time for get uh, being born time to die it basically says there's time for everything under the sun i'm going to put the scripture on the screen so that you read it for those that do not know what it says even though the bible says that as human beings it's it's easy to 
not believe certain things like you know it's there but you just you can't help but feel like <laughs> nothing is moving in your life even though other people want to be in your position you wouldn't even know like most people want to be in your position that's one thing we forget so like i was saying normally i'll be on instagram i'll be seeing people doing well i'm just like oh i wish i could do that not that i'm jealous of them i'm just like why can't i do what they're doing okay or why can't i be better or why, why can't i come up with something different you know but <laughs> I forget that I'm me and Teresa. Teresa's journey is different. Um, character B journey is different. C's journey is different. I don't have to necessarily go through what they went through. This is why some people, you know, the people who who go through stuff and then they say, ah. Yeah, I went through this for me to get where I am. So for you to get where I am, I'm sure you have to you will go through the same thing. If they went through like horrible experiences or whatever it was, they think you also go through that same situation, forgetting that they are not them. Some people even discourage other people to say, ah, you you never make it or you never do this. Or for you to be on my level, you have to do this, 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 this. It's not, it's not easy. It took me 10 years. And then you're just starting. You think, you know, all those things. When you're doing something in life, for example, I always use YouTube as an example. There are people who I started YouTube with that are doing well compared to me it like there are times when i'm like uh, like this week i can't even lie i've been a bit discouraged because um yes my subscribers are increasing right but sometimes i feel like i feel like it's not enough the videos that I do that I'm been excited to, like when I'm editing them, I'm like, oh, people are going to love this video because I love it. And then, no, <laughs> the response is not as amazing as I thought it would be, right? Yes, um, I always hear, um, why did you start YouTube? Is it because of the you just want to get a lot of views and you want to get more subscribers and whatever? Of course, I want that, but then again, I want people to interact with me. I want I want to see that people are watching. I want to see that I'm helping somebody. Like that's why I say you guys leave a comment if this has helped. If this 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 this. Because I want to get feedback. Maybe this is not what you're interested in. Maybe you want me to be doing fun videos all the time. Maybe I can't always do that, right? But maybe, like, I want to know feedback. I want to get feedback, you know? Or maybe there are things you want me to be talking about that I don't talk about. It's discouraging when... You're doing something that you love and you feel like the response is not that good but then again when I sit I'm like why am I bugging myself over these things the past month last month my views have gone up my subscribers have gone up there are people who are even commenting and they are saying, oh, uh, good job. That really inspires me. I'm like, oh, they like this. I should continue doing this. And then there are times I release 
a similar video and then it's like quiet i'm like ah what are we doing but people are saying these things because that's we're just being nice again it's hard for me to really <laughs> i love compliments but again sometimes i'm like mm, are they being for real or are they playing with me you know anyway i think i'm going off topic but my point is i am doing better than i think i am you are doing better than you think you are um there are people who want to be in your position that are not in your position there are people who aspire to be like you there are people who admire you there are people who are inspired by you there are people who are jealous of you and want to be you but they can't be you because they are only one person you know um we should always put that into consideration that we are all different we are all created to be different to be unique god has put um different talents different different gifts in all of us and we should always remind ourselves that whatever we are we're praying for whatever we're doing it's going to be worth it at the end of the day Rome wasn't built in a day that's what i have learned and guys most of the times it's easy for people to give advice it's easy for me to give advice and not follow my own advice but i feel like it helps other people and sometimes i go back and think and maybe watch my videos and like oh i gave this this type of advice mm, i should follow it you know um things are coming um one thing i've learned is hard work pays off if you work hard it's going to pay off i started this channel not knowing which direction to go of course like i knew that i wanted to do makeup guys my eyebrows are ish step some things they're just not even in the same family today <laughs> oh anyway I didn't know what I wanted to do with my channel. All I knew is I loved makeup. I loved hair. But my main thing was makeup. But as I went on, I understood that I've always known I've, I talk too much guys. I've always known I love to to talk. I love to help people. Um there are people who ask me simple things like oh how did you do your hair I'm like you know asking for my advice <laughs> just the smallest thing so like when i can come to this channel and show somebody how to do their eyebrows or how to do that tear that or the smallest thing that really gives me joy so when I started this channel, I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know how to edit. There was a point where I I wanted I wanted somebody to be editing my videos, but <laughs> I was looking at the money issue. I'm like, how am I going to how am I going to let somebody edit my videos and you know, I release videos every. I'm going in with my concealer. I'm going in with my concealer. I release videos twice a week. I'm like, how am I going to be releasing videos every week and paying somebody 300 till per video? And that's like 600 till in a week. <laughs> I just took it upon myself say i'm going to learn god i'm starting this you're going to help me you're going to see me through and he did i'm not the best at editing but i'm getting there and one day i'll be doing this i'll be editing like a pro you won't even see that guy um we all start from somewhere you have
have to start from somewhere. You just don't get up and everything is amazing. You start from somewhere, you learn, you make mistakes, you grow. That's what's happening. I am growing, I am learning, I am unlearning. <laughs> Um, not only when it comes to YouTube, when it comes to life, when it comes to friendships, when it comes to family, when it comes to God, especially that, like, if God is teaching me so many things, sometimes I sit and just like, okay, I get it. <laughs> so, be encouraged that you're not alone continue working hard this is coming from somebody who's still struggling when it comes to a lot of things when it comes to a lot of things life in general trying to figure out things uh, I don't have everything figured out which is a bit annoying because I feel like I need to get I need to know things by now like I need to figure my life out by now but then again the beauty of it is I don't know I don't know what plans God has for me I don't know where I'm going but all I can do is continue praying continue giving in my best and God will do the rest mm -hmm. and for those that are I'm going in my palette for my eyeshadow I don't even know what eyeshadow look I want I feel like I've done everything and you know guys I, I love makeup but I don't put on makeup as I used to I'm just in a different zone I don't know which one to apply which one to apply Continue subscribing, liking, and sharing. I love you. Till next time. Bye.